Hey guys, so today I'm going to do like a vlog slash what I eat in a day video because I'm home all day so I thought it was the perfect opportunity to film a what I eat video but I wasn't really like feeling like doing the proper setup and like getting the tripod and sort of filming like the preparation and all that sort of stuff. I wasn't really feeling the fancy video, you know? So um, I thought this was a good thing to do and yes, I'm just pretty much going to show you what I do throughout the day and what I eat and that's going to be it. I'm sorry my face is really shiny, I just put the <laughs> coconut oil moisturizer on and it takes a while to go in. So yes, I'm going to go make my breakfast. So I've just made some oats with raspberry and coconut on the top. This is what I've been having like every single day lately. And in there is just some like shredded coconut, maple syrup, chia seeds and a mashed banana. I've also got this water. I've been trying to drink a whole one of these in the morning. Um, sorry, the birds are really loud. I don't know if you can hear that. Um, yeah, because drinking that much water at the start of the day just really helps me feel good and really feel, helps me feel energized and yeah it's just a good aim to have I suppose but yeah I've been having the same breakfast like every single day um yeah I just love it and I feel like it's healthy like it's really healthy and if you find something that you love that's good for you then why not eat it every day Okay, I have a perhaps unrealistic goal that I'm gonna try and achieve today so this is why I sit outside when I eat because like being out here is so much more inspiring and like gives me so many more, you know, valuable thoughts than sitting in my bed and just watching YouTube. Anyway, it's funny when like I say that and I'm on YouTube, like, please watch, please watch my videos. <laughs> um, anyway, so, okay, so if you watch my other vlogs, then you would know that I'm trying to start up an Etsy, sh Etsy store. And at the moment, I have three prints done and I was aiming to have five by the time I launched. So, <clears throat> I have one that I'm, <coughs> no, my voice isn't good in the morning. I have one that I am, um, like, part way through, so I'm going to try and finish that and create another one today. And then by the end of tomorrow, I want to have my store up and running. That'd be good. So, I'm going to get onto that right now, do that, <coughs> go to Officeworks, get some printed, and, Yeah. Then hopefully by the end of tomorrow, I can have it all photographed and up on the site. And yeah, pretty much. Oh God, the birds are so loud. So yeah, um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. I hope I can, but I feel like this has been going on way too long. Like I've just been stalling this for so long and I've been working on, I've been doing a print like once a week sort of thing and I just need to get onto it and get it done because this is something I really, really want to do and that I'm really interested in and yeah, so I'm going to go do that and hopefully I can do it. <laughs> I might give myself till Friday because today's Wednesday. I might give myself till Friday night to get it up and running for the weekend. I'm not sure. I just like, I'm not going to rush it. I'm not going to rush it into these two days and have really crappy photos or crappy prints. You know, I just want to do it right. So <laughs> if you don't see it up tomorrow afternoon, then... I think by the weekend is a much more realistic thing. And also, like, launching a store, I want people to have time to go and, like, have a look at it and check it out. And they will probably have way more time to do that over the weekend and on a Friday than they will on a Thursday night, you know, you know? So, yeah, I'm going to work on my stuff. I'll just show you here. This is the one I'm working on now. I've got all these planets. They're not glued on or anything. And I've got this one over here that I'm going to put on. And then I seem to, like, <clears throat> oh, my God. <laughs> then I seem to, like, position them and then draw the stars. Um, by stars, I mean these white things on this one. And then I'm going to make one more, which I think I'm going to make a bit different. Um, like this one down here, Take Me to the Moon, is a bit different. And I want another one like that as well. So that one doesn't look a bit weird. So yeah, I'm going to get to it. And yeah, hopefully this works out. <laughs> It started to rain and this is like the perfect painting weather. My god. Yeah, um, sorry about this shirt. This is my Taylor Swift shirt from it's like a massive one that my uncle got me from the concert. And um yeah, it doesn't really fit enough to wear as a normal shirt, so I just wear it as a painting shirt. Um I don't really have any pants on either because I put I spilt paint, like actual paint, not watercolour, on my dancing tights that I was wearing. So they're in the and nappy standing. What is this? Oh my god, I've actually got paint on my face. Sorry about that. <laughs> um, yeah. A few of the prints that I was trying to do just weren't working and they were work turning out really crappy and it was really frustrating me, but now I um 
I'm just working on something else that I know is a lot simpler and is not going to frustrate me and yeah I'm just going to try and work on this and then go back to the other things another time. I think I'll open the store with these simpler things. Um, they're just like black background, moon or planet print um, rather than the other like really sort of complicated solar systems I was trying to make and then I'm going to try and work on them and add them at a later time probably. I'll open the store and then maybe like in a few weeks I'll add those ones. So yes. <laughs> I feel like when there's something that you really want to achieve through art and it's just not happening, it's so frustrating and that's sort of why I often try not to have an end goal, like I try not to picture what it's going to look like before I do it, but then because of that I often sort of just start doing things and then it's not working and it just really turns out really bad, so yeah, um, yeah, so I'll show you what I'm working on now. So now I'm just working on this moon print, it's really wet at the moment as you can see, but yeah, hopefully that'll be easier to do and hopefully it'll turn out really well. So I'm making a smoothie now. I'm probably still gonna have like a bigger lunch after this, but this is just, I don't know, I'm not that hungry at the moment. So maybe after this I'll make some like potato fries or something like that. Yeah, I've got a heap of spinach, mango and banana. I'm just gonna put a cup or so of water in there and it'll be ready to go. So the moon's over there, and then this is the one I'm doing now. I've sort of unintentionally made it look a bit like Earth, so I don't know if I'll actually call it Earth or just have it as a planet, but yeah, this is working out so much better than the ones I was trying to do before, my god. Alright, so I've done three, I don't want to call it, there's one moon, two planets, and I'm just waiting for them to dry before I glue them onto the black cardboard, and I think I'm going to add some like stars and some colour splatters and stuff to finish them off. But then I'm going to go to Officeworks and print. Um, I'll have six all up then. Two solar systems. One, the Take Me to the Moon print. And then two of, no, three of the planet ones. Um, there's another solar system which I just don't like. Like, I put a lot of effort into it and it took a while to do. But I just, I can't. Like, you know, I feel like when you're doing, when you're creating art, you can't like sell everything you make. Some things just aren't good enough. And that's the case for this one. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna keep that for myself, maybe put it up in my own room, because like, you know, I don't need to impress myself. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm just waiting for my moons to dry, then I'll glue them on, and I will be on my way. Right, so while those moons and whatever they are dry, I'm gonna go to the shop instead of near where I live. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to get some blank cards, because I was looking up on Etsy, I was sort of looking at like, what people are selling, and like, what is selling, or what people actually want to buy, and um, that's people sell little cards that they've made. I used to love making cards so, so much. So I thought that'd be a really cool thing to do. And I could put them with little envelopes and just paint like moons and that sort of thing on them. So yeah, I'm going to go get some of them. And yeah, I will keep you updated, I suppose. <laughs> we'll see what happens. So this is what I've made for lunch. I am um, trying to eat really healthy these days because... I'm trying to naturally get my iron back up because I was deficient last time I got my blood test, which I know is a thing that a lot of vegans don't like to admit, so I'm dogs are trying to eat the food. But yeah, like I'll be honest about it, and I'm trying to get it up naturally so I don't have to take supplements anymore. So I've got potatoes, carrots, spinach, spinach, um, tomato, oh my god, stop it, see. Um, avocado down below the spinach on the bottom, and then some fake chicken like tenders they're called from Gardein on the side because I really like the fake meats but they're not really nutritious at all and just eating that for a meal is so like yeah, not nutritious pretty much and it's not going to get me any of the vitamins that I'm trying to get um so yeah just mixing them with some veggies is a really good way to have it so then I can still have them and also have some actual healthy stuff <laughs> I've also topped off the um potato and carrots with some mixed herbs which I find makes them taste really 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 good um way better than just having potatoes and carrots straight Hey guys, so I actually forgot to film for a long time, um, but I went to dancing tonight. I um, had it for from 6.30 to 9 and now it's like probably like 9.30 and I'm just cooking some rice for my chickpea curry, which I will show you guys when I have it. And yes, <laughs> pretty much I just had a shower as you can see and um, I'm just going to relax. I think I'm going to try and find a new TV show to watch because every Wednesday when I'd come home, I would always watch watch the new episode of Scream on Netflix and now it's finished. So I need like 
I don't want to get into watching too many TV shows because it's not really what I want to do with my time. But like at these times when I don't really want to do any more work, I just want to chill. I need like something to just chill out and watch and just switch off for a minute. So yes, I am going to go get my rice because it should be ready and see you in a minute. So this is my chickpea curry. I know it doesn't look like much. I cooked it last night and I think I put a bit too much rice in today. Um, it's pretty much just chickpeas, tomatoes, coconut milk. What else? I don't even know, a bit of garlic and onion, actually. Um, yeah, and some red curry paste, actually. Oh my god, I can't remember any of the ingredients. But yeah, um, yes, chickpeas are really good for you, really good source of, like, iron and lots of other nutrients. And yes, as I said earlier, I'm trying to get off here, so I thought this was a good thing to have. Um, yeah, I'm just going to eat this and watch a TV show. I haven't really found which one I'm going to watch yet, but yes, I'll probably talk to you after. Okay, so I'm watching a TV show called The 100, which is pretty much about... Um, the earth is destroyed and everyone's living in space for like two centuries and then these kids get sent back down to sort of repopulate and check out the earth and it's pretty good. I've only watched one episode. I'm starting the second one now. But yes, um, I'm now, I'm now working tomorrow afternoon and I think I might have other plans tomorrow now as well. So like I'm not sure how the getting the Etsy shop up and running by the weekend is going to go. If not by the weekend, definitely by like Sunday, I reckon. I don't know. But like ASAP, I think I've pretty much done all the prints. I just need to try and find some time for it. But maybe Friday afternoon I might be able to as well. But yeah, like I definitely made a lot of progress today though. And I'm really like fully almost set up. Um, On Etsy as well, I like set up my store and, you know, made my shop front. And um, it's pretty much ready to just like upload the product. So that's really good. Really excited about that. And Yes, I guess that's all I have to say. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, even though nothing really happened. Um, same as all my other vlogs, though, and you guys seem to like them. My vlogs actually get the most views out of all my videos, so maybe I'll try and do them more. So yeah, thanks for that, guys. <laughs> um, yeah, so I hope you have a lovely day, night, whatever it is for you, and I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>